Alright guys, I'm bringing you a video here of Diablo 3. Um, this is patch, or actually season 4. So this is my Barbarian. I have not played a Barbarian in the past. And I made an interesting build here. And what I'm doing is I'm getting a 6 set of the Waste set. So that I can do most of my damage through uh, Dust Devils. And I'm also trying to get to a 3 set of the Immortal King set. Right now I currently have a 2. I'm fishing for the weapon right now. Once I get that done, um, Berserker will put in a lot more work. And the other set pieces I have here are Focus and Restraint so that I can deal some more damage. Now I currently am using this ancient weapon you see here. Um, a lot of crit hit damage and a lot of rock crit chance. So I'm at 49 now. When I buff up, I'm at 52. And then if I do um, my Wrath of the Berserker, and then that goes up another 10%. But over half of the times I'm going to crit, which leads me to my build. So I do have Call of the Ancients, and they are my Fury Generator, so that I can just spam Whirlwind. And while I'm in Whirlwind, I take less damage, so that's great. And here is where my healing comes from. Critical hits restore 1% of my maximum life. Um, ignore Pain is there to get me out of crowd control effects, out of snares, and it helps take less damage, so every now and then if I do get stuck somewhere, this helps out a ton. Uh, I may be removing this once I can have uh, Berserker up at all times. Battle Rage ups my crit chance, and every time I crit, enemies blow up with 20% of that damage, so that's, that's good for damage. War Cry. I do have it set to dodge chance. Um, I will be eventually the tank for a group of friends so that we can do a lot of uh, greater rifting. So I do want a lot of toughness. And Wrath of the Berserker getting 50% extra damage, that's always good. And I do like all the effects that come with that. Now my passive skills are unforgiving. I do like having full fury. Uh, rampage. This just overall gives me more toughness um, from pull to pull, and it allows me to just keep pulling. Berserker Rage. Uh, I am always at max fear. Well, not always, but most of the time. And Tough as Nails helps out a lot with that. I didn't have a lot of toughness before I got all this done. My toughness right now is at 11.7 mil. I know it's not the best, but my gems do help. I have Tygok, uh, rank 31. So he, that helps me out a lot. A lot of armor being gained there. And I have Pain Enhancer. And then the other gem I have is Bane of the Stricken, which does help just eliminate things a lot faster. Um, I'm running a lot of. Uh, I, I do want this yellow gem in my helmet just because I am still searching for my last weapon. Once I get my weapon I think I'll probably get rid of it. And I do have some Vit um, resistance and strength gems here. Now ideally I'll probably do all Vit. I'll end up doing all Vit. But for the time I don't have enough purple gems and I don't feel like running a broken crown to break all the set bonuses. So I have not tried this. I just you know equipped all of these items. I just found all this. Just transmog. And so let's try this set. I was running a six piece waist set, before, I mean, um, Immortal King set before. So let's try a regular Nephilim Rift, and then uh, maybe after that, we can try a faster one. I am doing this in Torment 7, by the way. So let's just see. Those dust levels are definitely getting hard. And you can see I can just keep spinning, you know. My ancients are over there hitting people. While they're not hitting people, I do have to stop. But here we go. I'm running through that dust level should hit it and kill it. Now I'm not going for the fastest times with this build, but I'm definitely going for something that's sustainable. And so let's see how fast I can melt away this guy. Um something else to note. My effects or the auras with the new cube edition 
Um, I do have the furnace added to my weapon. I have the ring of royal grandeur on my ring slot so that I can equip the two set. And the helm... I don't remember what the helmet's called, I just know that every now and then my attacks cause the enemies to explode in poison. It's really the only worthwhile effect I've found so far. I, ha I, haven't, I haven't farmed too crazy this uh, season. If anyone has some suggestions on what I can do for that armor, let me know. But from here on out, I'm just gonna go ahead and run this rift and I will speed things up. Alright, so that went really well. There was, I think, two packs that kind of hit me a little bit harder than they should have. Impressive. I think with this set I can jump up to a higher torment. And now, actually, I got different boots, so now I need to up that movement speed. So now we can actually go ahead and do a greater rift. So now I need to see how high I can get in greater rifts. But uh, I'll save that for next time. Ooh, those are ancient boots. That's nice. Alright guys, see you guys later.